Hey guys, so um, it's Vlogmas Day 5 and I thought I would show you some of the stuff that we've managed to collect for our homeless project. Um, I will pop the video in here um, that the kids um, filmed all about what they're looking for and um, what our plan is. So I will show you our stuff now, it's very exciting. So we were sent from Anna Faye's stores, um, a bunch of lovely ladies came and it doesn't include this, I'm just going to move that out of the way a second. Um, we were sent some amazing things, some coats, um, a sleeping bag to give to someone who really needs it. Um, we've been sent toothbrushes to divide up, ponchos wet wipe, sanitary products, toothpaste, amazing stuff, underwear, um, over here, such a good idea this is, they told me when they visited that um, if you <clears throat> go to McDonald's or Greg's they'll f give you free hot water so if we can hand these out to people then it means that they get to go in whenever they need one and they can have a nice hot chocolate. Um, I've also got from a um, lovely, reasonably interesting bl a blogger that I know who is adorable. She sent a load of stuff. So she sent scarves, clothing, gloves, and a nice bag that we can put some of the stuff in as well. Um, and then we've got some stuff as well over here from, as I just trashed my house, from um, the Georgia Molly's... Um, Nan, great Nan. She has given us loads of bags and goodies and in there are things like wet wipes. They've made these bags up already but we're probably going to have to go over them. We've even been sent a lovely box of wet wipes um, from a lady that I know on Instagram and she just used our Amazon wish list to send us um, some wet wipes in the post, which is amazing, 18 packs, so that's wonderful. So this all began because my children and I and Warren, we all kind of question things. We'll go into Cardiff and we'll see people on the streets or we'll see people busking and we'll, we'll, we'll talk about it. Um, I don't know many people that shy away from it, that don't talk to their kids about it. I know it's a dark subject and it's sometimes a little bit scary, but um, I think not talking about it is going to make the problem worse. It's not going away. So our plan was to, um, we had, we've wanted to do this for a few years now. We basically want to put together some um, backpacks um for the people living on the streets of cardiff with lots of things that will help them um maybe have food keep warm things like that if we could give more we would if we could give them a roof over their heads we would um but this is what we can do this year um i think it's going to be really exciting i think it's fun i think it's heartwarming i think that we're going to meet some amazing people we've already chatted to some people that live on the card of streets and um, their stories are sad and and you just wouldn't want to be in that position but because we're not in that position we can do something about it and we can help um, we can't fix the world we can't fix all the problems but we can make their lives that little bit less hard work that little bit less I don't know painful like if they've got food in a bag they haven't got to worry about the next meal um, We've also been given um, vouchers, I forgot to mention this, from Wild Thing Cardiff, a beautiful lady who is opening um, a vegan store, a vegan cafe, I think it is. I think it's cafe, vegan cafe cake shop, I want to say, um, in Grangetown in January. Her food, her Instagram, I'm just always hungry watching it. So that's really exciting. Um, we're still waiting for donations. We, we, we you can you can drop things off at Cate's Community Centre um, any time during the week. They're open till eleven o'clock most nights, I think. And we will collect once a week when we have the chance to pop in and collect. We will go in and we will collect the stuff and then we will sort it out. We've only got about two weeks to go now before we you no know, a week and a bit actually a week and a half before we uh, before we have to. Um, get all the stuff out on the streets and do it. I'm so excited. 
I, I'm probably going to spend the half the day crying. Um, we're going to get our festival trolley. We're going to load it up with all the bags. We're going to colour code the bags so we know the ones that have got feminine products in or the ones that have got women and men's clothing in. And we're going to hit the streets of Cardiff and um, hand things out. Um, I just want to say a few thank yous. I've got a list here. Um, thank you to Anna Faye's stores for your donations. They are greatly appreciated. Thank you to Wyburn and Wayne for mentioning us on their channels on Facebook. Thank you to Reasonably Interesting for um, your donations. Thank you to Kate's Community Centre for taking in all the stuff. You've been absolutely wonderful. Thank you to Wild Thing Cafe in Grangetown, soon to be open in January, um, for your donations. Thank you to Nanny Netty for your donations. Thank you to the lady that I know on Instagram, whose account is private, so I will not be seeing any of your details on here. But thank you, your donations mean the world. Uh, thank you to Cardiff Online and Cardiff Times for covering this as well. Um, just a massive thank you to everyone that's been involved and continues to be involved. I will put another shout out of thanks at the end of it to everyone that's um, contributed because we're still getting donations and help and stuff. Um, so now it's time for me to pass you over to George and Molly so you can hear their message from them to you. Merry Christmas! Hey guys! Hey! I'm Molly! I'm George and we're doing a Homeless Kindness Christmas project. So we're looking for donations of backpacks, blankets, pillows, chocolate, sweets, and any other food, and socks, and anything else you would like to donate. And maybe some wet wipes. We, also, we are donating them to homeless people on the 18th of December. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Bye! Bye.